name all the workflow components. So there are five workflow components that are available. And these are workflow rules, workflow tasks, workflow email alerts, workflow outbound messages, and workflow field updates. What options does Salesforce provide when we use workflows? So there are three events which Salesforce provides while defining workflow rules. Only when record is created, when a record is created or edited, only when a record is created and anytime it is edited to subsequently meet criteria. What are the limitations of time dependent workflows? So the primary limitation of a time dependent workflow would be the workflow cannot reference formula fields and the time selection does not provide minute or second level configurations. What are the different actions available under process builders? Well, this is a long list, but let's look at it. So the different actions would be create a record and that creation won't be just tasks, launching quick actions, post to chatter, update related records, launch a flow, call apex code, submit records for approval, invoke another process. In which scenario can we update a related record via workflow? Well, related records can only be updated via workflow when the relationship between the current record and the parent record is a master detail relationship. Can you add additional steps after activating an approval process? Well, no, the additional steps cannot be added to an approval process if it's active. Can you add additional steps after activating a process builder? Well, just like approval process, additional steps can only be added to a process builder by cloning a new version or creating a new process builder altogether. If a process builder is active, we cannot modify anything and the process builder is entirely read only. For which workflow event, we cannot create time dependent workflow actions. Well, the event is only when a record is created or edited. This is the event wherein time dependent workflows cannot be created. What can be done via workflows but not process builders? Well, the one thing that can be done via workflows and not process builders is sending out outbound messages. The last question, can we delete records via workflow? No, deleting records cannot be done via workflows, but it can be done via process builder if we invoke Apex code from it.